Now, every single morning, Lynn got me these, but it's Element. Here, I'm going to show you guys. It's Element. It has sodium, which is really good for you. It has potassium. Potassium? Potassium. Potassium. Guys, I'm still learning English, even 10 years after. And it has magnesium, which is really good. 36, it's like 40 bucks, but every single morning, I know you guys watch me take all those like little shots, and this is just as good. It's very different, but I really enjoy taking this before running, lifting, or just literally starting my day by drinking this. Now, I got a good girl thing. I'm on a path by the end of July, which I have about 15 days to have more visible apps. I've been running at least twice a week so far. I go in the gym five times a week and also eating less junk, eating more fruit like a watermelon, kiwi, oranges, all the good stuff. And I got a new honey too. Actually, hold on. I'll show you the new honey. Are you excited for honey? She loves honey. So, this one is called Mitisa. Man, I'm probably pronouncing it the wrong way. From Spain. And look at this. It looks so fancy. It has like a cap bottle like this. Let's have some right now. Nana, you want some? Baby Nana? Not too much. I know, I know. Wait, wait, wait! Relax, <laughs> relax, crack it. It's getting you mm -hmm. Yeah, it's honey, it's raw honey. People eat that with like a cheese board. But it's healthy for you. Wait, so here is another fun fact. This little puppy goes crazy over bananas. As soon as I say banana, she goes crazy. Right? You want a banana? Okay, 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 okay. Relax, relax. If you guys have a puppy or a dog, let me know if they're obsessed with a banana. Just like how it is. Like she would... She would donate all of her toys just for a piece of banana. It's crazy. I wish she was a little one. Sit. Wait. Okay. Now sit. Come on. Come on. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on. Yes, no. Look at her hand. Look at her hand. <laughs> So guys, I'm gonna put this on the TV right now, but I started a new audiobook. I have like multiple that I'm listening at the same time. This one is Good Influence by Zach Perna. I think I'm saying it correctly. He does pretty good money. He is a YouTuber I'm trying to learn more about content. As you can see, I'm trying to create content. And he's fit, um, he's rich, and I would say that he's rare because there's not many people who can do both and also have a partner, good relationship with other people. So it's a six hour audiobook. And Spotify now has audiobooks for free. So if you have Spotify, like the premium, it's free. So instead of paying money on Audible, this is really nice. To share possibility. We're about to explore the foundations that are vital to staying consistent, getting the most out of yourself. Then, he suggested I blow into something else, and my lessons were never the same again.
just came back from the gym and I decided because I want to lose more weight, it's better to do cardio after weights. Right, my love? So I'm gonna have this protein drink, which is not my main protein source, but it's pretty good. 32 grams of protein and the ingredients are almost there. We're gonna have a little bit of honey and then pre-workout. Crazy, huh? Pre-workout after I work out and do back and vice. So I have energy to go running. I'm probably gonna do four to five miles, come back, be in the sun, get tan without the shirt on, listen to an audiobook. I feel like every single time that I start an audiobook, I need to finish it the sooner the better. So the one that I showed you, I'm gonna try to finish it this week, maybe even today. I know, a lot of times I get nervous talking to the camera because I feel like I need to be somebody who I'm not, but I do understand that it's better to just be your authentic self because that's what people are craving these days. Somebody really missed somebody else. Okay, 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 okay. Don't give her too much banana, her shits are yellow. <laughs> okay, 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 small one, small one, small one. So for the pre-workout, I started using Bulk which is very, very strong. It's by Transparent Labs and all the ingredients are pretty healthy compared to a lot of companies like C4 and all those companies use a lot of artificial ingredients that are really bad for you. So always look into the ingredients. This is pretty full, so I don't really use this, but when I'm really, really tired, then I use it. But most of the time I try to stay away from caffeine I don't like depending on it. It does feel good. It's it is technically a drug. And I love having caffeine. But at the same time I don't want to depend on it. But it does feel good. You know what my, my you know what my routine is mm. when it comes to running? Mm. I like to drink a lot of water, which means I have to go pee pee. Mm -hmm. And then there's a bathroom over there in Terry Pines mm -hmm. that I just go pee. And then I start running. So that's like my, like, the calm before the storm. Okay. Because you can't pee on the beach. There's a lot of kids over there running around. So here we are, starting the run. I'm feeling the caffeine a little bit. And you know what? Because I took caffeine today, I have a lot of thoughts, really deep thoughts, that I usually get while I meditate. And one of them is basically, how do I get to a point of having location freedom. How do I make money while sleeping? And that is all with a personal brand, which is exactly what I'm doing right now. So one step at a time, ask yourself too, what is it that I can do today to move one step forward to be financially free? Whether you have a nine to five, fuck the nine to five. You cannot make money and be rich from 9 to 5. Don't have a boss. Maybe if you like that, but I'm not that kind of person. I like to do what I want to do. So with that being said, point one, two miles, and I'm gonna finish. I'll do probably four to five miles today. That's my favorite part. Story Pines. Story all the way from there. We're gonna go all the way over there. Beautiful water today. And just like that, finished the run. I was kind of tired, but I kind of understood what's my pace now. My cruise control pace, which is about 8.30 to 8.50 per mile. I did about 4.2 miles, and I think I can do easily 6 to 8 more. So even more like twice what I did today, as long as I go in that pace. And then from there, just go faster and faster. But Right now, we're gonna get some protein with creatine, as always. And I have two types of protein that I usually take. So I usually take this one, two scoops of this bad boy, which is 120 grams per scoop. But I went to Whole Foods and I started trying this one too. It's organic. I don't like it that it's plant-based. I don't like plant-based stuff. I like red meat and I like, you know, it's organic, it's good, 30 grams of protein. So before I even eat anything physical, I already have 32 grams of protein, 
and then another 30 to 50 because I usually do almost two scoops. So I do one scoop and I do a little bit more. So I would say just under 100 grams of protein before I eat. And I'm going to have some steak, some eggs. Eggs is literally a life changing active ingredient. I mean, food. It's really good for you. Make sure that it's pasteurized and organic. It's currently the middle of July. My goal, I'm at around 193 right now. When it comes to pounds, my goal is to get a little bit, a little bit leaner, but at the same time, I want to have visible abs and have more body weight, more muscle. So that's my current split. I do push pull legs. We're probably gonna try a new gym soon, which is the compound, which I've been there. But this right here is my breakfast. Now, if you drink protein shakes all the time, one thing that I would highly recommend you getting is a water bottle, like a protein shake bottle with a spinner, where you can just spin it and just spins. A lot of times it doesn't get all of the protein, but it makes life much easier. So I want to talk about some life updates. It's so cool that I can see myself. Also, what do you guys think about this camera? I invest a lot of money and time into researching the perfect one. This is the ZV-E1. I love this camera. It's expensive. I was thinking about getting this smaller thing. It's called DJI something something. It's like really tiny and like 60 frames per second, which is pretty good. But let's not talk about the cameras too much. Let's talk about life updates. Before I went for a run today, I got caffeinated and I really do feel like when I'm caffeinated I have more ideas and I do truly want to achieve my goal of having location freedom. Currently I have a business that I sell digital products, audiobooks, ebooks and also paperbacks. That's not digital but Amazon fulfills it and it's audiobooks like I mentioned and it's on Amazon. I have almost 40 titles which is books and it's basically passive income so far. And I keep thinking like, if I 10 x did, 20 x did, what can I do? But that's not my passion. Real, like, real estate is also not my passion. Audiobooks is not my passion. I think fitness and creating content and talking to you guys and helping people get out of their comfort zone, go out there, whether it's to go to the gym, whether it's to talk to the girl that you want to, whether it's just taking the step to be uncomfortable, and helping men because I know when I was 230 pounds I was not comfortable with my body with myself I woke up every day and I was not happy like I was not happy <laughs> I remember I told you guys me tying down my shoes was a challenge and I was just sweating so now me running four to five just under six miles is easy you know not that it's easy but it's easier like I can do I can go to the gym for now I can go work out afterwards, I can do the sauna, like it's just completely different lifestyle. And I want more people to implement the actions that I take in order to get a better life. So this is why I created this YouTube channel. Yes, I talk about real estate, I show you properties and I show you a lot about real estate specifically, but also I wanna to talk to you. Like I'm a person too, trying to grow my personal brand and I'm trying to help other people. So if you are into the gym, if you are into eating healthy, and improving yourself, specifically as a man, I think most of you guys are men that are watching me, then keep watching. I'm going to keep creating content on Instagram, Facebook, specifically here on YouTube. I mean, I got this camera for a reason. This motivates me to go out there and you record more. Me recording today in the ocean on the beach, right? Everybody looked at me. It was weird. Or maybe I thought that way. But to me, I was uncomfortable and I want more people to be uncomfortable every single day because comfort is the silent killer. When you're comfortable, that's when you don't take action that would set you apart. Whether it's going to the gym or whether it's eating healthy, going for a run. To me, I just woke up one day on a Saturday and I was like, you know what, I'm going to start running. Let's just start running. I don't like running, but you know what, it's going to help me. I will be able to be outside, get the sun, the vitamin D see people fun fact let me tell you a small story i was running on the beach one day a few weeks back and somebody came up to me 
And he was like, hey, Alex? Alex? And I was like, hey, because I'm pretty bad with names and I don't see really well sometimes. So I'm just like, oh, who is this person? And they come up to me and they're like, oh, like, I watch all of your YouTube videos. I'm excited to see the video that you uploaded for tomorrow for the property in La Jolla. And I was like, wow, that's so cool. You recognize me from YouTube and you're just sitting here on the beach and you just call my name. So it is working. It takes time. And yeah, I mean, it made me super humble and excited to do more. But my protein is to be drank. Is it drank or drink? Drinked? Anyway, and then we're gonna go check some properties. We're gonna do some chores. Maybe go to Whole Foods and just show you also what I do kind of on a daily basis. So I just showered and this is gonna be my first meal. We have half a steak, six eggs, and what else is inside of it? Spinach. Spinach, and then this is a patty. It's grass fed. Actually, I'm going to show you the meat that we like to use. It's grass fed, and there's a, ro a lot of really good stuff inside of it. Is it this one? Yeah. So it's grass fed, also it has ground beef, beef liver, and also beef heart. I mean, honestly, I think this is one of the best beef that you can get for your money. That's baby, now that's food. Right, mamas? And then what I like to do every single time I like to eat, I just like to watch something. I also love Jack. So if you're watching this, man, I appreciate your work. And yeah, this is going to be about 70 grams of protein. These two alone, and then this. I'm pushing about 100 grams of protein right here. And then we also have some organic kiwi. Whole foods, whole foods. Gotta get some whole foods. Let's grab two of these. If you get beef, especially ground beef, make sure that it's grass fed. What does it say right here? 100% grass fed, guaranteed. Vegetarian fed, right? That means that they were eating grass and they were outside. And it doesn't mean that they were eating like a lot of stuff to make them even sicker and bigger. So make sure it's ground beef that's grass fed. What are you looking at, baby? Which one isn't good? Can I get more of these? You wanna get these ones? Let's just get, uh, oh no, only the three, the top three. The top three one? Okay, I'll get it. Always really inside the creatine. Creatine is really good for you, taking it once a day. The variety is not the best. We got two options. 45, 45 servings, how many of this? 60 servings. We didn't film everything that we got, but at home, we're going to show you exactly what we got. I mean, as you can see, we got some chocolates too. Okay, so we just got home and I want to show you exactly what we got. It's only for a few days, not for too long. We already got plenty of groceries over the weekend. So this is kind of just for, I'll say a few days. We got the beef that we talked about, ketchup. We're going to make some tacos. So of course we have stuff for the tacos. She likes the taco shells. I don't. I like kiwi, very healthy for you for poop too. Oranges. I also decided to go with this. Creatine, pretty happy about that. I got a brand new soap to use for the body wash. This is our treat. So this is one of the best chocolates in Whole Foods. White chocolate, Lynn really likes it. So we got it, we got two of them. We got some kebabs, mushroom salad, pico de mayo I think it is, onions, lettuce, and of course, lettuce like pieces so and one of these bad boys which I already had so pretty pretty simple what do you guys think so Lynn just finished cooking we're gonna have tacos but I'm not gonna eat the taco shell because it has carbs and I'm trying to cut down so right here we have some lettuce we have what is this baby Cinco de Mayo stuff Pico de Gallo Pico de Gallo and then the grass fed beef and this is how I get to about 200 to 220 grams of protein I hope you enjoyed the video 
hope I inspired you to start working out and also joining my journey because I'm trying to cut down and have visible, visible abs. With that being said, if you're a man, work on yourself, you're number one, and then everybody else is number two. Make sure you're mentally healthy, physically healthy, and keep pushing because you can do it. So with that being said, I'm really hungry. I'm gonna go eat and that's Vidanya.